As a small holder, this was virtually my favourite shovel. I say was because the handle rotted and sheared off. And being not too bright, I have no idea how to get that old wood out of there. I drilled the rivet out, or best I could, and tried to drift it through, and then tried to drift the wood out. It wouldn't work. Anyway, a friend of mine told me the answer. Now, I've got a an advantage over a lot of people in that I do a bit of blacksmithing. There's my blacksmithing half there. And the idea is when I've lit the fire I'll put the end with the wood close to but not in the fire because I don't want to overheat this steel and take the temper out of it and I'll just slowly bake the wood till it turns to ash and knock it out. As we go on today I'll come back to this and show you how it's gone. Then hopefully I can go and buy a new handle tomorrow and rivet a new one on and I'll have my favourite shovel back. Although I think now looking at it, the edge needs a bit of work, but I'll sort that out with a file. Okay, I've got the fire going in the forge now. You could use any sort of fire for this, a bonfire, whatever. Obviously that's not as controllable as a forge, but the principle's the same. Now that might be a bit too fierce that, so I'm going to move it a little bit. I just want to cook it gently. Let's give it half an hour or so and see how we get on. Okay, that's been in the fire about half an hour now. You can see the wood inside is actually on fire. Gently though. The idea is it'll all just come out. See that's well alight now. Just leave that to gently cook and I'll knock all the ash out. Mustn't get that steel coloured. No colour in it at all, we don't red or yellow in it at all. It'll take the temper. Okay. That's become too hot to hold with hand by hand now. I use a pair of blacksmith's tongs to pick it up, knock it all to that. Look at that. Perfect. Whole thing came out clean as a whistle. A little bit of colour in that uh, steel there. I'll leave that to cool on its own. I won't quench it in water or anything like that. I'll just leave it to cool to one side. That's what came out. All nicely carbonised, carburised. The rivet's probably in there somewhere. I'll have a look when it's cooled down. I can buy a handle for it tomorrow. Yay!